thanks so much for the slime. Uh, where's the waste yeah, I gotta get out of here before he traps me. Ah, uh, good day, everyone, and welcome to another episode of X Life. So, you guys. <laughs> Last episode, I built this gorgeous, stunning, beautiful homo. I'm very pleased with it. Although the reception wasn't as welcomed when I asked the three girls who stole my turtle to come over. They were really rude and disrespectful, if you ask me. But you know what? I'm still proud of it. You guys seem to like it as well. But there were some comments in the last episode that were like, whoa, what's that in the background over there? and uh, I'm gonna show you guys in a bit. Uh, Flip created a clubhouse for four heart players and I died again in my last episode and now I have four hearts. So that's a thing, unfortunately. But also fortunately, I get to join a clubhouse and since clearly the Unholy Trinity girls don't like me, they don't want me in their group, and they're bullies, I now have a group of other people in the Four Heart Club. So, without further ado, let's get Flip and let's go explore that new clubhouse. Alrighty, you guys, so, okay, is it Flip or is the F silent? Flip or whip or wh whatever, <laughs> <laughs> whatever really works. Okay, well, I'll call you Flip. Um, okay, so I see in the distance that there is a four heart clubhouse over there. Yes, yeah, it's a little bit of throwback to Kids Next Door. Uh, <gasps> Whoa! <of> Whoa. <laughs> I didn't even think about that. That is so cool. Okay, so you built that all yourself? Yeah, and somehow it didn't die in the process, so I've, uh, I think that's pretty good. It's, <laughs> it's four heart safe, as I as I'm liking to say about oh it right God. now. That would have been so funny if you you were building a four heart clubhouse and then suddenly my, you're my in the... secret plan for it was because i put the four up there i was just gonna scratch it out and write a five and <laughs> say it was a five heart clubhouse oh but uh God. thankfully i didn't have to do that so yeah oh. are you gonna make a clubhouse for every time that you die not saying that you're gonna die but like i i'm hoping i can at least live in this one for a little while now yeah. we can all hang out there before uh that happens but i know since this has happened a few other people have uh, talked about making their own clubhouses like, uh, <laughs> scott was on earlier and he's working on the two heart clubhouse right now so oh my gosh it's so hard to last that long with two hearts how, how what were your deaths very very sad i lasted 40 minutes death by crocodile nine oh. minutes death by crocodile oh no <laughs> was it the so, same one uh, thankfully no the, okay. the first one he and i killed each other at the same time it was actually kind of sad and really bummer like i i like hit him and i fit, i died off my one heart <laughs> oh, and i looked no. over on the desk screen i'm like there's there's crocodile drops sitting on the ground over there this is this is just sad <laughs> oh my god well glad you're still here you got four hearts same as me since you are like the king builder of the server i was interested to get your take on my new build so first of all first impression what are your thoughts i love all the colors in it i would say one thing i might change yes. is the roof it just feels a little thick you know because like, okay the build down here you have a lot of detail into yeah, it yeah yeah with like you have a lot of the depth inside of this one and uh -huh. the fences and everything going around it but then the roof feels a little just blocky okay. compared to that. Yeah. And I, I don't know if those bamboo ones have like slabs and stairs and everything. They do have and stairs. Stairs could work or there was the, I might stop, have some in my backpack. I don't know if you're looking at it. Oh, they do have slabs as well. I use this well. on the clubhouse. There's the reed thatch block. <gasps> oh. If you haven't checked that one out. And this one I think also has a vertical slab, which if you're trying to make that really big arched one right there in the center. Yeah. And for me personally, I always find those working on evens are a little, <laughs> they're hard. They're hard to do. What do you mean uh, working on evens? Building it. What's that mean? Uh, just how you have the you have the two wide doorway and then yeah. it comes up to two blocks at the center. At yeah. the top, that's always just a little, those are a little rough to do. But the vertical slabs, thankfully, <laughs> thankfully in modded, those can actually help with doing, I think, uh, do I? Nope, uh, they're all back at home. Yeah, looks like I don't have any of those on me right now. But if you don't have the slabs and stairs and everything in like this one right here. Yeah. You could use that, or I don't know if you have any smooth white block or whatever it's called. I, I was looking at it earlier today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or if you have, I this would be going to the nether, but the, the quartz could actually work as a cool like highlight to the roof. What's a highlight? It, it, 
just like a just a different color to it just adding a little bit of my i don't know i feel like the yellow and the roof being the reed block it just feels like the bottom is so smooth because you have all, like the this pink color right, right here is right. So very smooth yeah and then you got the texture in the wood which is kind of muted a little bit it's like a little bit like washed out of uh -huh. sorts and then the roof block is just kind of like bam true okay i see that for sure i was just trying to get a yellow colored roof i was going off of the mat well actually it's not yellow it is kind of like this thatcher thing which i didn't even know this block existed because it's a thatched roof so yeah. the fact that there's an actual thatch block how do you make that it's bamboo thatch. and sugar cane oh so it's actually pretty easy to get a lot of it oh, i was able to get everything that i used for the clubhouse over there and i probably took like an hour maybe? okay well i it can i have a lot of the the outline of this roof is all bamboo blocks that can be mm -hmm. repurposed into regular bamboo again so i can just oh focus on the nice. sugar cane <laughs> roofs are just so scary i'm nervous so oh, wait gosh, I know. what what shape how should i adjust the shape with this new block using stairs uh, or slabs oh i got i got a fancy new tool <gasps> cpk showed me earlier is that you a gun the sun going down yeah and, oh, it, there we go. Morning time. Whoa. I love it. It's so cool. Magic. <laughs> that is so cool. It's a timeline. Ooh. Oh, <laughs> sweet. I literally saw a CBK like an hour ago or so, and he's like, look at this thing I got. I was like, oh my God. I need one. one right now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Damn, that's sick. But let's see if we can, if I can pick these up. If you went with like this front one, uh, let's see if I can do this here real fast. We got that one right there. And then that one comes just doing like a. Is that okay, okay. Up? No, that's wrong. Okay. Because <laughs> instead, we're, yeah, for me personally, I like for roofs, like doing the slabs and stairs and things on it. Okay. Instead of like where you have the full block right there. So maybe you could bring this out a little bit and then. <gasps> Whoa, that already looks so much better. And you could even arch that one up even more. So it kind of comes up to like Whoa. this main central point. You did that so fast. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> That is so sick. So you do something like that with the shape. And then one thing I would say for the bottom uh -huh. is if you, you can make it cause you have the fences on here on the corners. Yep. So you can actually make like, and make it actually look pretty good. If you have the overlay, like go out even more. Okay. So if you have like the whole overlay around that edge, sure. You just add like another stair like that going around the whole thing. Uh, so so like stick out another block. even more, another block from outside of that edge right there. Yeah, I got some, let me see, let's jump up there and take a quick look. Okay. But if you brought it down to even like something like this height, obviously okay. it's in the same block. Yeah. If you brought it like that, and then that could kind of, wherever you, if you're planning on putting any windows outside of like the big guy, like if you, I don't know if you're planning on putting any inside of here, but you could like angle that, let's see here. I'm so new to modded that I don't know anything. Oh my god, about you only play here. in vanilla usually? Oh yeah, no, I only play vanilla. Survival. Oh wow, this must be like a whole new world for you then. Yeah, I'm just like, there's so many blocks here, I don't <laughs> even know what to choose. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but if you have any like small windows that you're planning on working with, uh -huh. uh, you could kind of angle them around here, and then you can do like this little, I, I love doing this, where you have like a little tiny upwards Ooh. divot right there. Ooh, so you have like yeah. the window would be like right in the middle of this one. Oh my, you know, I need to just hire you for an extreme home makeover <laughs> edition. <laughs> that is so helpful, thank you. Yeah, no problem. Let me see if I can get down here without killing myself. Yeah, good luck. There, You, you are at a bit of an angle, so just be warned. Should be good. There you go. <laughs> okay. If there's one thing I'm familiar with, it's dirt scaffolding. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, sweet. Thank you so much. Um, I will definitely work on this later on, but I think we need to get down. Oh, no, no, keep this, keep this. I need this example. Keep it? Okay. Yes. Right. <laughs> I'm going to forget. <laughs> well, I think we should get over to the treehouse and have a little tour over there because it looks so totally. cool. Yeah, it's a, it's good to look at from afar. I know I kind of barraged you when you jumped on a few days ago. I was like, oh my God, you have to come look at it right now. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I literally come off of finishing it and just dropped down to the ground. And I saw you had logged in. I was like, wait, his house is right over here. Whoa. He's standing right there. <laughs> This is, so who all is in this four player or four heart gang? You, me, Shelby, and Mika. Oh, okay. Right now. So there's, there's four of us. <laughs> wow. I don't know if either of them have checked it out yet, but so far it's uh, 
It's pretty empty on the inside. I've kind of actually, after we were talking last time, yeah, we were talking about, I know you had mentioned wanting to move in. I decided to divide up the rooms a little bit more. So there's actually a little bit more space up here. So we got kind of like a hangout spot down here. The lovely, I love these Whoa. lights. The fairy lights are literally my favorite thing. Oh my God, yeah. So far. <laughs> Welcome to the world of fairy <laughs> lights. <laughs> oh my God, I'm using them everywhere. Oh my gosh. But yeah, I don't know what Whoa. would really be down here, but up here I was figured like, if everybody wanted to split it up and make some rooms, we got yeah. like, a smaller spot down here. And then coming up to the top point, there's kind of a larger room. And then it, there's even like more. Oh my God, it keeps spot. going. Yeah. <laughs> this is so This is so kind of where it cool. ends up right now, but. So we can all have our own like little room. Yeah, I, I, I figured we all need a place to hang out now that <laughs> there's yeah. more than just me. And I was like, all right, I need, I need to make something for us to hang out, you know, get an actual clubhouse here. And oh my God, we can plot. The Let's plot against the other players to make them lose more lives. <laughs> this can be the war room. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. Exactly. Right in front of the big four. There. <laughs> this is so cool. How long did this take you to make? Um, outside of gathering the resources, I think building it was about three hours and I managed to only fall off twice. And you survived. So there's uh, there's a few ponds down at the bottom, and those were uh, those were there because I flooded oh, the entire okay, okay. area around the build. <laughs> wow. So in in homage to the puddles uh, saving my life, I added some ponds underneath that tree. Nice. <laughs> oh my god. Well, this is so cool. Thanks for making a clubhouse for us. I will be moving in shortly. I'll find a cute room in there and start decorating. Sounds great. I, I can't wait to see. I'm I'm not one for interior decoration too much, so I, I'm hoping you all can kind of oh. screw stuff up the inside of this one. So yeah, we definitely can. <laughs> By the way, Perfect. I think I heard that you are a bit of a slime dealer on the server. I am. Yeah, I I, I do have some slime balls available. Yeah. What well, what's the what's the going rate for them? So recently, I've been just to make it fair for everybody else. I've been doing one diamond for ten right now. Oh so oh, fabulous! No, you know what? I will <laughs> gladly take you up. On that offer let me just All run right. on home i will meet you over at your house in just a second i gotta run on home and get some as well oh okay it's a little bit of a mess right now it's it's had better days but it's uh <laughs> whoa what you building out here i i wanted to go for like a mediterranean <gasps> villa theme wow. of sorts so starting starting off the building in here this is so Slowly. cool oh my god your sugar cane is so high yeah, the, the bamboo and sugar cane. Oh, that's bamboo, back. not sugar cane. <laughs> yeah, the sugar cane can still grow to be like 15 blocks tall. It's insane. Do you have to do anything this... special to it, or does it just do that on no. its own? <laughs> just wow. leave it, and it does it. I don't know what crazy mod that is, but it, it works pretty well. Nice. All right, here is your diamond. And here, here you go. There are the slime balls for you. Whoa, pleasure doing business with you. Totally, yeah. How did you even get a hold of slimes? Uh, I found a slime chunk down below under my base, and then I can actually show you. It's right down there. A slime chunk. It's, it's safe. There are there are some slimes down there. They kind of hop around and do their own thing. What do you mean by friendly, a slime kind of. chunk? So in Minecraft. Uh, everything's divided up into chunks, like the way it all loads in, like there's the big tiles that load in around you. Yeah. There's a chance for some of those to be a slime chunk, which basically means slime can spawn inside of them. And thankfully oh. with this, that lovely mini-map mod that Scott got for us, uh, yeah. we can just, you can make it look for slime chunks and they light up green. And so if you just kind of clear that out down at the base, it makes it so you, they just spawn down there. Wow. This so. is the most inter- I feel like I'm walking down a staircase to hell. This is it's, it's, very it's interesting. <laughs> <laughs> there are some of the little oh! green guys down here. They're, they're fine though, they're fine. Wow. Why do yeah, you have diamond so boots years. on, by the way? I got them from a wandering trader and they have feather falling five. Ah, uh, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> So nice. this that that's also what kept me alive while building the tree. So they've been, they've been good friends. But yeah, so I got a slime chunk down here and I moved this spawner inside of it so it spawns these lovely little guys and then they I didn't try even and get know that was golem up there a and then thing. the cactus kind of stops them. Wait, I didn't even know there's slime spawners. There aren't. The lovely modded <laughs> as I'm finding. Uh if you you can get spawn eggs 
uh, in this game. I got one from a chest that just had a slime spawn egg. Oh. And apparently with a mod, if you right click it on a spawner, it'll yeah. change what it is. Ooh. So I took a zombie spawner and turned it into this little bit. So guy. you got a slime spawner where? Like a, uh, the egg? Random chest I found in the caves around here. Oh my god, you're, uh, you're so brave. Scary. I cannot go in the caves. I get too nervous. <laughs> if we go like halfway back up the staircase, I've been slowly trying to light up this big cave so that I can get more slimes to spawn. Uh, this one right here, careful oh for the god. edge. It's a... Uh, I've been slowly working at this it's, uh, to get where it's at because I'm going so slow. It's That's taking terrifying. like three hours. Oh my god, yeah. It's, yeah, I'm, I don't know if it's worth it. I really don't know if it's worth it. <laughs> is the diamond shield you have on, is that like the best shield? It's the best one that doesn't slow you down. Oh, okay, so okay. You, you can make an obsidian one, but it makes you move slower. And I figured mm. you know that with the, the crocodiles that roam these mountains, I kind of want yeah. to move fast. <laughs> you, you have um some prisoners? <laughs> uh yeah they're they're all they're they're safe those ones they live in the they have a large area then these ones have a little uh, <laughs> little capsules over here where they live it's fine <laughs> cap wait they oh my god sirs blink twice if you need rescuing they're fine they get bread it's okay sure yeah mm -hmm. it's okay definitely things got They'll a little soon weird have a down great there villa to roam around in i just it's like that whole i gotta build the place before they <laughs> have a place to live and uh, oh my god you this is a little twisted you have chickens trapped in a one by one block yeah but I think I gotta go. You know, this is th th <laughs> thanks so much for the slime. Uh, where's the way yeah, I gotta get out of here before he traps me. Oh, <laughs> him and his magical. Don't worry, there's gonna be some lovely assisted living homes inside of the. Uh... Sure. <laughs> okay, well, I gotta go. Thanks for everything. Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll meet up at the clubhouse. I swear it's safe over there. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty, thank you. I think I know just the place of where to get a bunch of sugar cane. The unholy trinity actually has a bunch of sugar cane, if I remember correctly. So you know what? I want to go there and I want to take it's rightfully mine. They can come to my place and steal Mr. Ninja. Then I can rightfully take some sugar cane. So I also need a little bit of food because I'm starvation nation and I don't rock I'll, I'll take it. Let's cook it up. All right, so let's head on over there and take what's ours. Alrighty, so it's actually the next day and the roof is completely gone. So let's go outside and take a look-see, shall we? <laughs> She's bald. Her wig was snatched right off. <gasps> oh no. Uh... <laughs> It really does look like a wig was snatched off. Okay, so, um, yeah, this is gonna be the new roof. But, uh, before we do that, I want to work on the second floor of the house. Just so I can have a little bit less fall issues. I put this water down. I also am, like, questioning, do I make a enchanting table so I can get feather falling on my booties? Hello, the sun is setting. Hi, bud. There's so much things I want to do, but don't know what to do. <sighs> I guess I could just put water everywhere. I made a bunch of the thatch roof, although that's not nearly enough. Um, I do need to get my sugar cane. So I'm gonna finish making all the thatch. Wait, is all my sugar cane gone? No, I still have some. Yeah, I think I'm honestly gonna need more sugar cane, so. Oopsie, I legit thought that I had more than enough sugar cane, but clearly I did not. So, let's take a look at what he did. I think it's pretty much all stairs. So, there is some of the squares, but mostly stairs. Which is good for me because I think I can make more stairs with everything. So that's gonna be the roof. I'm nervous to go back up there, you guys. I was so terrified. I built it from, I de-built it from inside so I could fall onto the water. What do I do, what do I do, what do I do? I, I definitely think I need feather falling. Like, that's no doubt. So let's place the enchanting table down and maybe I can just put like iron boots on. Feather falling one. I think that's probably better than nothing. Sure, we'll go with that. Although, maybe I could get Feather Falling 2 if I made more iron boots. Let's, let's, let's just try that. Second pair of iron booties. Ooh, I don't, <laughs> I don't have an anvil. <gasps> oh no, do I have iron? I have one bar of iron. Okay, just kidding. I guess I'm gonna just be stuck with the Feather Falling 1. 
I think I'm gonna go into the mine, get some levels, and I'll be right back. All right, well, I'm back from my mining adventure. I got a crap ton of iron. Oh, no, <laughs> it's raining. <laughs> go to bed, go to bed. <gasps> Can I? This is dangerous. Oh my gosh, no. I don't have a roof. Bad guys are gonna start coming out. <gasps> oh, this is bad, this is bad. Um, well, I got a lot of iron, as you can see, and a lot of gold. <gasps> the sun's coming out! <laughs> Yay! Whoa, look at the clouds dissipating. That's so pretty. Um, okay, so, I also got, I got a lot of Goldilocks and the three bears, so I can start making some golden damn apples. Fabulous! Okay, so, ho, 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 let's get down to, oh! I enchanted my boots. I have Feather Falling 1, so we are good to go with the building. I hope, I wonder, I don't know. Feather Falling 2, 3, 4 would obviously be better, which I'm going to eventually build up to, but for now, these boots will do. So I need to figure out what to do with the roof, so I'm going to map it out down there first. So I want to get some of the thatch. Looks like I already have stairs, so we're good there. But I do want to make sure that this is exactly perfect. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Maybe that's not right? I'm confused. Okay, so if he was able to do this by standing, I should be able to do it, right? I need to take a picture. Okay, let's see if that works. Did I get that right? I think I. No, something's not right. The top piece is not right. Oh, it's supposed to be a staircase, not a block. Got it. Ah, oh, it's raining again! Okay, but at least we got the roof shape down. That's actually kind of cool as like an archway to like walk through. Okay, I need to get inside even though I don't have any shelter. <laughs> come on! Let's do the rain dance to make the sun come out. Maybe it's a thunderstorm and I can sleep. <gasps> yes! Ah! Oh. Fabulous. We love sleeping the rain away. It's a magical trick. That is such a cute archway. I kind of live for it, but maybe somewhere else. It definitely doesn't make sense right here. Um, but I need to replicate this on the roof, which is terrifying. I do have feather falling. I do want to put some buckets of infinite water out. I'm going to destroy my grass, but you know what? You gotta do what you gotta damn do. No, buddy, 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 back, back, back. You know what? He'll be fine over here. Okay, no, 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 you're gonna, you're gonna end up going in there. I'm just not gonna build the roof over there yet. Okay, everything seems to be covered up except for these chests and stuff. Hopefully I can manage to not land on those. That would be unfortunate. Yeah, I think this should be enough. Let's actually do the sides of the house too, just in case. I love how I managed to do the whole first roof without doing this, but you know, I just don't want to risk it again. Okay, let's try this. Where do I start? Here? Okay, I think, I think I was able to do it. Let's, um, let's try this side again. And then we'll look down there and see if I got it. Okay. I think I did it. Let's go down and see if I did. Fingers crossed. Oh. <laughs> oh no, what did I do? What am I missing? <laughs> Something looks very, very wrong here. <gasps> I need to put a staircase there and I need to just get rid of all this pink. Okay. Yeah, let's try that. Okay, I think that should do it. And then I guess I didn't really think about filling this in. Well, looks like there's gonna be some holes in my roof. <laughs> Oopsies. Oh my god, I didn't even think about that. <laughs> okay, I guess I can close them up with more blocks like this. Uh-oh, out of pink. Okay, let's go get some more and then we'll go look outside. We also need to sleep. This is turning out all right. It's not terrible. All right, let's see, let's see, let's see. It's not bad. You know what? I'm going to push it out maybe two or three anyways. So you're not even gonna notice the holes. Yeah, you won't, you won't even notice the holes. 
Okay, I'm gonna go mess around with this and um, check in with you guys once I figure it all out. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I've hit a wall with the sugarcane incident issue problem that we have going on. So this is as much sugarcane as I got to make the planks, but I do have a little sugarcane farm growing in my backyard, which is probably gonna take a few hours to, okay, I need to go inside to get. So in the meantime, I think I'm gonna work on the inside of creating a second story of this house. So what I'm gonna need to do is figure out a color for the second floor and I think I found one it's called this one dark blue green plank I think it'll be oh my god I really gotta sleep um, I think it'll be a good accent color for the cyan floors and I think I'm gonna go with that but I also want to create a staircase that leads up there so I'm gonna mess around with some staircase options and I will update you guys in a moment okay y'all I've been making some major damn progress and I'm making a basement right now but here is the inside of my house look at this we got some framing going on, some edges that are snatched. We got a staircase that goes up to a second floor. Look at this. We have like a little balcony area. I'm living my best life. I'm still working on the roof. I'm waiting for the sugar cane to make its way up to the hilltops so I can go in and cut it. Oh, we have a visitor. Hi, visitor villager. How's it going? So I'm gonna let those grow a little bit more and then we can hopefully finish the roof, but it's looking so goody goody gumdrops. Let's take a little look, shall we? We shall. Oh, stunning. Look at the improvement I have made. Isn't that truly shockingly beautiful? It's taken me a long time, but you know what? It's worth it in the end. I'm very happy and proud of my work. So, hmm, what can you say? But yeah, right now I'm working on the basement, which is going to be my chesticle room. I'm clearing it out, which is so much easier with these amazing tools. So this took me like no time whatsoever. So it's looking at pretty good songs. Yeah. Um, so let's, let's just, I hammer these down look how sickening now I don't really know what I'm gonna do for the colors down here I think I'm just gonna make it a little basic for now because I want to get I don't know more things I might want to theme it to be something you know something Alice in Wonderland themed so if you guys have any suggestions of what I could turn this basement theme into let me know but for now I kind of just want to make the walls all just be a solid white or something for now we can always change it actually should i leave it until you guys give me the suggestions no it's kind of scary down here if i don't put color or anything okay well i'm gonna mess around with this area i honestly think i'll probably just do all white stained planks or let's see if i have any other a lot of a single color because that might have to be what it is I have a lot of cyan and a lot of purple. We can make it a purple room. I think I'll do that. I'll make it purple just for now. And like I said, you guys give me some suggestions what I should do for the chest room. I don't know. Ugh, do I waste my time putting all the planks down? I think I'm just going to leave it like this and not put any planks. Yeah, we'll do that. Okay, okay, okay. Hold up, hold up, hold up the phone. Hold the phone up. If you have a phone, hold it up okay thank you so this just in there are cool freaking mushroom chests look at how pretty and magical that is so alice in wonderland so it requires mushroom blocks which i can only get with a silk act silk silk act silk touch pickaxe so that is my mission for today is to find a silk axe silk silk you get what I'm trying to say. Silk touch. Oh, hi, sir. What do you have to trade? Oh, I was hoping that he would have. Silk touch. Um, three emeralds for diamond, jungle sapling. Oh, no, I would never want to go to a pillager outpost. Thank you very much. Okay, wow, these have grown so big. 
Okay, so I've seen several mushrooms and I think there's actually some over that way, if I'm not mistaken. Um, but anyways, I think we need to start with a silk touch pickaxe. Oh my god, I need to stop saying that. This <laughs> is becoming a lot. So I need to look up and see what enchant that is. I don't know if it's level 30 or you can get it at a lower level. So I should probably figure that out and then I will be right back once I do. Okay, I can't figure it out. So I, I am assuming that you could just do it when and wherever. So I'm gonna make a bunch of picky axes and we're just gonna, you know, hope for the best. Nothing here. I don't know what salvage is, but cute. Okay, I can also enchant these things. I have a feeling I need books. Miners for forever. I don't even know what that is. For fervor. Miners for fervor. <laughs> All right, I'll try one more enchant. If not, I'm gonna see if there's anybody who might have it or, dang it, I don't know. I don't freaking know what to do. Okay, I think what we're gonna have to do is Either look for more traders, which could take a while. Oh, she's been fishing AFK to try and get one. Okay. Damity Dam Damerston. What's a boy to do? I think I really need to get books. And to get books, I obviously need the sugar cane, but I also need leather. Oh, hold on, hold on, I got the slime balls. There's a thing that Flip was showing me with the glass container. I used the lasso, the golden lasso, for it was something. Okay. Two diamonds, two slimes, and a lead. Do I have a lead? If I don't, I, I had two, didn't I? <gasps> I do have one. Oh, ho, 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 <laughs> Okay, two slimes, two diamonds. Okay, so basically there's a, a mod on here that you can take an animal Put them in a glass jar. <laughs> that sounds really weird. Put a chest under it and it starts spawning some of their meat or leather. Well, if it's a cow, it'll have leather. So, okay, I got the I got the lasso. Right click to ch capture a mob. Oh, this is just fabulous. Just freaking fabulous. All right, so let's go find ourselves a cow. Wait, I should probably figure out what that thing is, that glass box. Ma oh, it's this. A wooden mob farm. A stone mob farm. An iron mob. Okay. Um, what are the differences? Oh, okay, that requires stuff I definitely don't have. Okay, oh, a bookshelf. Rotten flesh! D -d 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 definitely don't have rotten flesh, that's for damn sure. I could probably get some tonight. Oh, I'm scared. I don't want to battle anybody. The sun's going down. People are on the server, so most likely it's not going to work because people are going to make it daytime. It's so terrible. Okay, I just want to spawn some in, and then once they're out there, we'll let the sun shine and burn them. And then I can go out and get what's rightfully mine. Aha, okay, I see a zombie out there. Let's sleep. <laughs> Burn, baby, burn. Give me that gorgeous rock flesh of yours. All right, let's go out there and let's get it. Hello? Any bad guys out here? Just here for the rotten flesh. Oh, what happened? Oh! <laughs> oh, that's right. That'll teach you. Ooh, a lucky block. Oh, strange that it's just there. I don't know if it's a good one or a bad one, so I'm just gonna leave it alone. I don't trust it. Okay, so here's the tea, late teas. I need to look at this recipe. Oh my God, look at my house. That looks so much better. I'm so glad Flip gave me some constructive criticism on my house. <sighs> okay, so what I need is four bookshelves. Damn it. I need those bookshelves. <sighs> we could go explore. We could go on an exploring mission to go and find books. I mean, we have to go find a cow anyway, so we might as well go on a little quest. We can use the waystone to go far away. 
I think that's the plan for today. Yep. We'll take a waystone to get home, maybe? Actually, let's make some of those waystone maps. You know what I just realized? I still only have a medium backpack. I should make the largest backpack. What does that require? Oh my god, it just requires four leather, four wool. What am I doing? Whoa! Look at all that space I have! Oh my gosh, I'm ready to go explore the damn world. Alrighty. This is good. This is getting real good up in where? Up in here. We got some food. We have our golden apple. We have everything we kind of need. Let's go find some books. Let's go explore the world. We will go, do we want to go to the desert or should we go far away? Let's go to the far field. Okay, let's split up. If I split up, let's just go find, hopefully an abandoned building that has the bookshelves and, ho oh, look at this cow. Hi, sir. Hi, Kawifa. Oh, lots of cows. Okay, which one do I want? Do I want the brown cow, the black cow? Ooh, there's there's an inverted brown cow, a regular brown cow, and then the two. Oh, this one's so cute. This is like a classic cow. I'm taking that one. Oh, and the rest. I'm so sorry. You're all gonna be slaughtered. It's all for a good cause, though. So don't be alarmed. Thank you for your service, for your food, and for your leather, Anya. Something tells me I probably should have brought a book. Oh my god. Wait, no. I meant to say a boat, not a book. I should have brought a boat. I am so sorry, Cowby Fuzz. I have stumbled upon the gorgeous cowlands. I didn't even know they existed. Hmm. I don't know if I'll ever need pumpkins, but it doesn't hurt to take some. Ooh, look at all the pink flowers. Yes, mama. Get into it. Alligator, 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 leave me alone, sir. Leave me. Oh, multiple alligators. Okay, we gotta get up here. We get, oh, okay. Yep, big, big alligators coming. Oh, they've already killed some people. Okay, we need to. We need to get somewhere safe. Lay down a bed. Sleep till we can't sleep no more. Is what we gotta do. Okay, we need to get out of the fucking savannah. So I am just going to build a little boat. We're gonna sail ourselves out of here let's go find ourselves a nice village or one of those little shack houses okay y'all i've come up to two stru oh three structures four structures what the heck okay so we have a boat we have some sort of wow there's a lot of structures over here what the heck's going oh there's like drowns over there i don't know if that's like a pillager outpost thing so I'm like nervous to get close to it. Oh, but I see a chest right there. Oh, I'm so curious, I'm so curious. And the drowns can't really do anything. Okay, do we start with this? Here, let's first, let's first get out of the boat. Let's go here for a second. I have system nervosa right now. Keep an eye on the prize. <gasps> a bottle of enchanting, emeralds, iron, Lapis. Let me store some stuff in my backpack. This is so crazy. Okay. I feel like that bottle of enchanting will come in handy later on for something I don't know. There's usually multiple chests. There's like two per ship. I'm scared to go in here. I feel like a little swamp monster is going to come and grab my foot. Any bad guys down there? <gasps> There's a chest. Buried treasure map. Ice essence. Don't know what that is. But I have it. I got, oh, I got some books and paper. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. How incredible. Okay, buried treasure. Oh, we got a treasure. Ooh, wee. Okay, okay. All right. Let's, let's, um, let's store this in our backpack because it looks like we have more loot to acquire at these buildings. So let's be, Calm, careful, collected. I wish I had a bow. That's, I did have a lucky bow. Okay, that's that's on the to-do list is to get a bow. Um, let's make a run for it. Ow, I got, I got more essence things. Oh my God, why are there so many of these things? I don't even know what they are. Oh, that looks, that looks scary. I don't know if that's like a trap or what. Is that a trap chest? I need to like break around it and make sure it's not a trap. Okay, it's not a trap. 
<gasps> water essence, magic essence, wheat, more fishing rods. Guys, we are getting some major flutazoids. Okay, the drowns are right there. Come here. I can get them out of the water. Let's go up here. Let's first check. Oh my gosh. I hit the freaking jackpot. Life essence. Magic essence. I need to figure out what the heck those essences are. It is Joey's damn birthday today. Oh my god, another one over here. Another buried treasure. Guys, guys, this is this is unreal. Dark essence. I already got one of those. Oh, wow. Wow, wow, wubsy, 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 wow, wow. I kind of want to see what's in this. Nothing. Okay, good. Oh my god, okay, this was so scary. Wait, do you think this is a whole temple? Like, do you think there's something in the middle of this? I feel like we should place a waystone down just to come back here in the future and like, you never know. That was some major freaking loot. I'm gonna right click this and put temple. There might be a temple underneath this and these are just like the four spires coming out. Like they're all in a line. I think there's something in between here. So we'll come back to the temple at a later date. Let's sleep here at the dark temple. We'll get, we're gonna get the stuff that was down there. Fabulous. Okay, now we need to deal with these damn drowns. Okay, how do we get around them? Cause they can't walk on land. So we're safe with that apartment. Where's the chest? What are you doing, sir, sir? Oh, he got nervous. He said, I'm coming for you. And then he's like, oh wait, I can't. Okay, there's the chest. We'll wait for them to come back. Oh my God, poison essence, fire essence, more life essence. Life essence is so pretty. Okay, I think it's just that one chest, so we are good. I'm feeling freaking fantabulous about everything. All right, all right, Joe, you're seeing things. Okay, so how many books do we get? Should we go after buried treasure? No, I feel like we should come back for the buried treasure another day. Um, we've already done so much, and we have the temple here to bring us back. What is this? I thought they were rubies. Okay. I, what was that? What the hell are you? Ah! Don't look at me, you creepy thing. Okay. I need to look and see how much leather we ended up getting. Nine leather. That's not enough. Okay. So we need to... <laughs> Although I do have the cow. I have the cow. I need enough for four bookshelves, and then we should be good on the leather situation. So four bookshelves equals six books. Oh, what's this? Oh, there's a villaggio. A gorgeous villaggio. <gasps> Please have some books. Although this villaggio kind of reminds me of that weird tribe thing from One Life. Who remembers that? <gasps> okay, I don't think it is. I think this is a good, a good village. Okay. Y'all got any books? Got any books? Ooh. Ooh, y'all got paper. I'll take the paper. I'll take the water. I'll take the darkness. Give me all your darkness. Thank you. Come again. Look at this cute little village. Uh, ah. More papel for Joey. More bread. Don't mind me. What are these traders? Any of them want to trade me for a silk touch? Ah, another chesticle. Solid white gray, oh, just what I actually need for building supplies. Who knew they had such good building supplies here? Guys, I am hitting the damn jackpot. Hi, sirs. Any of y'all wanna trade? Don't wiggle your heads at me. This is a big village. Oh, oh my God, this is too much. I don't, oh, little baby villager. Look at his little flower crown, that's cute. No jumping on the bed, little boy. Okay. Okay. Oh, look at the kitty. Oh my gosh, there's so much to freaking see, explore. I want this. Give it to me. <gasps> a brewing stand? Oh my god, this is too much. This is too much. I feel like I'm cheating. Oh, well. Let's just pretend that never happened, okay? <laughs> don't know why that happened. Why don't you guys trade? Can I only trade with the wanderers now, I feel? Maybe I have to do it with an empty hand. I guess... Is that like an update that I just don't know about? Is you can't trade with the villagers anymore? Yes, oh, hi. <laughs> is your head stuck? Oh, that's really creepy. Okay, I'm gonna take this smoker. Ooh, there's a house up there. Hold up, is this marble? I've been looking for marble everywhere. It is marble, oh wow. Okay, 
I really outdone myself this episode. I just want to thank the spirits watching me who are guiding me through this and, you know, really giving me everything I need in life. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Y'all have an infestation of wild animals up here. Excuse me. Let me inside. <gasps> oh, wow. Compass. Oh my gosh. I feel so bad. I'm like literally stealing everything from this village, but they don't know. Okay. Whew. Okay. All right. I think it's safe to go explore these last two houses. And then we're just going to go home. I think we, we don't want to get too greedy and then lose everything. Oh my gosh. Another freaking chest. <gasps> Gemeralds. Oh, the solid white gray is exactly what I need. So that's real. Oh wait, I can just go like this. Why haven't I been doing that? Oh, hi. Oh my God, he brought his friend, he brought his friend. Are you mean, are you mean, are you mean, are you nice? I don't know. Okay, last chest, last chest. I love this rainbow thing. Okay, I really gotta go. <laughs> I really need to go home, recuperate and just bask in all that I've achieved. So I'm just going to this scroll. Where's this scroll gonna take me? No, it's bound to the temple. That's not where I wanna go at all. It's like we're sleeping here for the night. All right, I need to find a bed. Gotta find a bed before I get killed. Y'all got a bed? No bed? Okay. Y'all got a bed in here for me? All right, I'll just set my own bed up. You know, I guess I can't have everything from you guys. Oh, my bed is definitely not here. Okay. So unfortunately the scroll is only gonna take me to the temple area, which I don't really know how to get back to. So I'm just gonna do it. It's whatever. And then from the temple, we'll just teleport home. Home sweet home! Oh, and look at the sugar cane. She's growing tall and strong. Okay. Oh, wow, this has been quite the episode. So let's make that thing. What even was that? God, gunpowder. I didn't know gunpowder was a thing or a bone. Why didn't I look at that? I don't think I have any of those things. <gasps> I do have TNT. Can I decompose the TNT? No, I can't. Okay, I don't have bones or gunpowder. So we're just gonna have to make the mob thing another episode. I think we, <laughs> I don't know. I think I'm done pretty much for today. I, I really wanted to make those chests, but we'll just do those in a future episode. Um, I'm gonna finish my roof off in between episodes so you guys will come back to a fresh new roof. Guys, we've done way too much. I've spent so many hours on this episode. I just gotta end it here. If you guys enjoyed it, please slap that like button. It really lets me know you're enjoying this series. But until next time, I'll see you next time. Good damn 